Hello viewers today we are talking about Antoine Watteau, a pioneer of Rococo art. Antoine Watteau, a prominent French painter of the early 18th century, is renowned for his contributions to the Rococo movement and his ability to capture the essence of elegance, frivolity, and melancholy in his works. Born on October 10, 1684, in Valenciennes, France, Watteau's relatively short life was marked by artistic brilliance and innovation. Watteau's early life was marked by hardship and determination. Orphaned at an early age, he moved to Paris in his late teens to pursue his passion for art. He initially worked as an apprentice to various painters, including Claude Gillet, who introduced him to the world of theater and masquerade, themes that would later become prominent in his own work. In 1709, Watteau gained recognition with his acceptance into the French Royal Academy of Painting and Sculpture. His early works primarily consisted of scenes from the Commedia dell'arte, a form of Italian theater known for its colorful characters and masked performers. These early paintings showcased his skill in capturing the vibrancy of theatrical life and the contrast between reality and illusion. Watteau's groundbreaking contribution to the art world came with the development of a new genre known as the Fête Galante. These paintings depicted elegant gatherings of the French aristocracy in idyllic, pastoral settings. His masterpiece, Pilgrimage to the Island of Sathera, 1717, exemplifies this genre, featuring couples in elaborate attire engaging in leisurely activities on a fictional island. The delicacy of his brushwork, the softness of his colors, and the dreamlike quality of his scenes earned him the nickname, Painter of the Fates. Galantes. One of Watteau's defining characteristics as an artist was his ability to convey a sense of melancholy amidst the beauty and frivolity of his subjects. His works often exuded a bittersweet atmosphere, reflecting the transient nature of happiness and love. This emotional depth set him apart from many of his contemporaries and contributed to his enduring popularity. Tragically, Watteau's life was cut short when he succumbed to tuberculosis in 1721, at the age of 36. Despite his relatively brief career, his impact on the art world was profound. His innovative Approach to subject matter and style helped shape the Rococo movement, which dominated European art. For much of the 18th century, Watteau's influence extended beyond his own time, inspiring subsequent generations of artists. His emphasis on capturing the fleeting moments of human experience and his ability to infuse his paintings with emotional depth left an indelible mark on the development of Western art. Artists like François Boucher and Jean-Honoré Fragonard continued his tradition of painting scenes of amorous dalliance and pastoral idols. In conclusion, Antoine Watteau's brief but brilliant career left an enduring legacy in the world of art. His creation of the Fête Galante genre, with its combination of elegance, theatricality, and melancholy, remains a testament to his innovation and mastery as a painter. Watteau's ability to evoke complex emotions through his art and his influence on subsequent artistic movements solidify his place as a pioneer of Rococo art and a beloved figure in the annals of art history.